Guys, welcome back to my kitchen. I have a treat for you. I'm making some juice. Um, I'm making some pineapple and carrot juice with a hint of ginger and lemon. This is one of my juice I created. I says it's a great summertime juice, but I live in Florida. When it's not summer, except last week, we actually had some 40s and 50s degrees. But as you know, that didn't last long. So in this pan, here I have um, a can of 100% pineapple juice. This is, what size is this? 16 ounces. Now if you have a juicer, which I do have, I'm choosing not to, you can always juice a, a fresh pineapple. But that baby's gonna get peeled and sliced up and go to the fridge. So here's my blender and I have some, some carrots chopped up over here. I'm gonna add in the blender. water, enough water for this carrot. And I'm just going to blend this in high and I'm going to juice it, strain it into, into the pineapple juice. So um, when I'm on the last of the cat, I have a pinch of, this is fresh ginger. I like to keep my ginger in the freezer because it lasts longer. You peel them and put them, cut them in whatever sizes and put them in the freezer. I also peel them and grate them because I put it in my water and the great, the great ones I use in my water. So on the last batch of carrot juice like this, I'm going to add the ginger in there. So when I come back, all the carrots will be done. Okay, it's time to, to do the second batch now. Here we go. Remember the ginger has already been pulsated in this batch with the carrots. So you Oh, I can smell that ginger. Thank goodness Jade's not in the kitchen because she's like, Mommy, seriously, ginger? Yes, it's good for you, girl. You know, your mommy knows what's best for you. You don't. This would be the end of it for me, except for maybe adding the lemon. So I cut a nice lemon here. I'm just going to use a half of it because again, it's I'll taste it. Maybe I, maybe I can add the rest. Who knows? This is a large batch, so. Here I have a cup of brown sugar and more. It's perfect, guys. That is so refreshing and good. I know you're gonna enjoy that. Wow. Awesome. So what I'm going to do now to store it in the fridge, I'm going to pour it in this container right here. So guys, that was just a short, short, quick, simple video on how I make some refreshing homemade juices for the, for the Florida weather. But you can enjoy it too if you're not in Florida. It's not just for us. It's one of my tropical juices, you know, island girl using her island ingredients. Guys, I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for watching. Have a blessed day.